Back again, folks. You just can't get enough of me ugly mush. Keith here from Command the Hoop Celtic. If this is your first time coming across the channel, please do subscribe. So we all know who's going to be the referee for next week's Cup semi-final at Hamden Park between the Rangers and the Celtic. The Celtic. The Celtic. The Celts. The Hoops. The boys. Whatever you want to call them. The Glasgow Celtic. So um, it's going to be Bobby Madden. Bobby Baldy Bobby Madden, this is the eighth time referee in this fixture between these two sides. He sent off four Rangers players in the past, one Celtic player, and that was near Beaton last season. He stashed out 23 yellow cards to them, 16 to us. He's rewarded Celtic three penalties against Rangers in this fixture, and no penalties have been rewarded for Rangers. Jesus Christ, I can't believe I'm even saying this. So there's been no penalties rewarded for Rangers, considering the amount of penalties they've been rewarded in other fixtures this season is shocking. It's getting as bad as bingo, the amount of numbers at this rate. So um, he's going to be the referee next week at Hamden. Could have been worse. Could have been John Beaton. I thought Willie Collum done a decent job at Ibrox, to be honest. I'm not a man of the referees, as we know. I'm very anti-referee, but you know he, he kept his cards in his pocket for only the series incidents and but the only thing I want to criticize Willie Collum on regards to that fixture was Joe Hart brought to his attention about the glass and the pitch and he took forever to react. He was like a headless chicken out there when before the second half kicked off. So Bobby Madden, let me know his thoughts folks. At the end of the day, next week there's gonna be a big call on the VAR decision in Scottish football will be implemented in after the Qatar World Cup. Hopefully, it's going to cost clubs up to 40,000 quid. But at the end of the day, if it gives clarity and f sorts out these dodgy decisions in the Scottish game, I'm for it. I'm for it. I know people are like, oh, well, it takes too long. You know, like a team scores, we celebrate, and then we have to wait up to nearly a minute to get a decision right they'd have to go up to the screen about a possible sending off or a possible offside by a toenail off i can understand that but i'm far far i know it was an absolute disaster in the premier league when it started but it's it's getting better it's getting better you know once we don't have corrupt referees doing the var in murray park i think we'll all be happy so let us know what you think i'll speak to us all soon hell hell